Boo. Hey, what up everyone? Michael B. Petty here. Um, got another react coming right your way. I'm sorry that I missed the Torrid Hall a couple of days ago, but I was in Los Angeles visiting some family and friends. Um, I had a really great time. You can see some of my pictures from my trip on Instagram at Michael B. Petty, so go ahead and follow me over there. The Torrid Hall, in my opinion, was pretty uneventful. Um, yes, she bought a bunch of clothes that didn't. she knew wasn't going to fit her once again. I don't know what the deal with that is still. I'm still trying to figure that out. Um, it's amazing to me how much excess she has in her life that she can just like order boxes and boxes and boxes full of clothes that she's not gonna wear. Like it really boggles my mind. Um, I do agree with everyone else. I do think that she's not looking that great. Um, it's really sad to see. It's sad to see that she is not taking the lymphedema on her abdomen as serious as she should be taking it because I've looked at some of those pictures online and that's not pretty. So I can't imagine why she wouldn't be rushing to the doctor of some or a doctor of some kind to try to figure out a way to mitigate some of that. But you know what? It's her life. Amberlynn's going to live her life. She's going to do what she wants to do. And we're just going to have to watch because I don't think there's anyone at this point that can knock any kind of sense into her. So it just is what it is. But I'm kind of excited for this react. It's uh, some something about shopping and then a Halloween haul. The thumbnail's pretty fucking ridiculous. So without further ado, let's get into the react. Hey guys, so welcome to a new vlog. I don't know why, but the power just went off for two seconds and then came back on. It was like a flicker. There's no storms, blue skies. It has been raining two days in a row. We needed it. Be I'm so glad we needed to know about this. Like I sometimes I will. Okay, well, this blog, this vlog is 21, almost 22 minutes long. So I don't know why she's having to add this in, but okay, the power went out for a second. Cool. I'm happy for you. Like, it's so dumb. Because it didn't rain for like months. No joke. So. Yeah, it's called seasons, dog. Like, it's not, doesn't, it's not supposed to rain every month. Like, you live in a seasonal area. Yeah, I'm just. There's different weather patterns. Just got out of the shower, just getting ready for the day. I just wanted to come on here and say hello. I'm pretty aggravated i oh. have been waiting for the shane makeup and merch and this and that like i've been waiting like a crazy person i love shane so much i've loved him for so long now his series i cried at least twice every twice episode. twice every episode or video I feel this is my thing with that whole Shane stuff is I feel like he uses emotional components to get people to like buy into his stuff. And I get it. Like, I think he's an emotional person and everything. But like, she is that person that would fall for all the bullshit. Like, oh, my God, we're so poor, but we live in like a couple mansions. Like, I just I can't get over it. I'm not going to like cry over someone making millions of dollars. Like, who fucking cares? Like, these people have been rich for a long time and they will continue to be rich. Yeah, whatever you want to call it. It was so. Oh heartwarming like what I mean, words for it that they so released I a makeup line alarm set on my phone like i literally sat there for this is what we've come to waiting to the we're like in a cry for people making amazing, money online so he it's broke so the stupid. internet and it wasn't working so i sat here for three hours refreshing the page every five minutes i feel like she read about this on twitter and now she's recounting it because it's relevant <laughs> and just now which is it's been four hours now I went back on and everything I wanted is sold out. <laughs> Good. You don't need it. You don't need That's any more shit. That's my luck. And Good. I know that he's you going don't to need any stock, more. and I'm just so proud of him. I wish I could, like, tell him. You have tons of makeup you don't even use already. You know, I look up to him so much, and I think that's a really big reason. Well, then why don't you lose some weight like he did? Then why? I've been getting into makeup. I've always, like, loved makeup, but I've never you know what done the eyeshadow and done the highlight and all that stuff like it's been very gradual and seeing him like just has inspired me so much and i i love this i i can't creating new looks with my makeup now am i the greatest no am i even that good probably not then why do you but need all these all Anyways, of this makeup i kind of have a busy day tomorrow's our little party situation so I party have situation party if you can just say it's a party store. we're actually gonna go hang out with some friends that we haven't seen in a hot minute and it's just i'm it's glad you're getting out of the house today. so 
Buffalo. Oh my god. Oh, she's gonna fall on the stoop again? It's too bright. There we go. God. No, I think I prefer this way. The heavy breathing. So we have a surprise. Harry Potter lives with us. That's not very <laughs> Isn't nice. Isn't the cutest thing? Oh my god, it's bright. Amber is literally turning into destiny. Like, I is this... Is this Oh, this is Amber. Becky is literally turning into destiny. Like, is this her way of keeping Amber interested in her and, like, to not be so, like, hyped about destiny coming back around? Because that's what it feels like to me. Like, look, that's li like, if it wasn't for the chin area or whatever, like, you, that's destiny. Like, that's full, like, the green sweaters and everything. She got glasses. Oh, babe, they turned into sunglasses. Yeah, you knew this, right. Amber. Don't play yeah. this stupid. Those puppies were almost $300. Tell me why. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I'm next because I should be wearing glasses, but... Hashtag can't see. She would say. <laughs> I should be wearing glasses, but mine broke forever ago and I slept in gone. Like, you need to see anything. Oh, out to eat. Here we go. Where are we? Applebee's? So we just hung out with some friends and is she in now her scooter? It looks like she's in her we're scooter. getting stuff for the party tomorrow and look at what I ran across. You drove across, you mean? A whole thing of mochi. Strawberry, dolce de leche, vanilla bean, pumpkin spice, sweet mango, cookies and cream, double chocolate, get a veggie green tray. tea, vanilla Do the world a favor and pass this by and just get yourself I'm a veggie tray. Shooketh. Becky, she's in her car. Not amused. She's you full blown like in her car because of her angle. You don't like this? She's looking up at <laughs> Becky. Okay, you guys. So it's the next day, Halloween party. One of the games is guess how many candy corns is in here. So I'm in the middle of counting them while no one's home, and there's just a lot of other games I have to organize. I'm super excited. Wow. So they all actually fit perfectly. So you guys should leave your guess in the comments below of how many no one cares. are in here. And I can reveal it in my next vlog. If I remember. Amber's so party sounds like the most boring me. party of all so time, dude. Oh my God. <sighs> this is like aesthetically pleasing for a Halloween party. Why? Because it's candy so in a glass? Everyone's curious. These are actually the games I have planned. There's going to be Trivia. a candy corn guess I just showed you. Obstacle course. The size Who's of the doing pumpkin, the obstacle like course? The of it. There's going to be a trivia contest, a costume contest, an obstacle course, Halloween scramble, which is where you unscramble a bunch of Halloween words. This, don't mind this. It's because is this a party for a bunch games, of like I merged two games second together, graders? which was candy corn and pumpkin weight. We're going to play a few games of spoons. It's a card game. We're going to do a Halloween art contest, an eating contest, a doll poem. We're going to like compete who can do the best like spooky poem. And they have to so boring. Like, read it out. So Everyone boring. So funny. There's going to be a sca scavenger hunt, what's in the box, and a pumpkin picking. It's like when you, I so, can't, dude. It's like um, when you go to the Boys and Girls game, Club. <laughs> like, it's literally that. An amount of money. And this one, oh, actually, you get money? The pumpkin picking. Oh, we're bribing our friends to hang out with us. Different prices. A lot of them have zero dollars, but you just pick a pumpkin, and whatever it says on the bottom is how much you. Want. I feel like. There's better games to play at a party on Pinterest than like what Amber came up with, or if the, I don't know, is that like a BuzzFeed list she came up, she found? Those games sound so incredibly boring and dull. I'd be like, who cares? When this is the last game of the night, it's more calm and collective, and it's for people calm who and like collective. didn't have a. Chance Are they gonna to color too games? at the end this of the night? More, is there gonna so be like a coloring luck, station? So this isn't quite everything. But Those here are some of are the finger foods, donut holes, touch it all? covered raisins and whatnot, cookies. Could you imagine like being Eric and like setting all of that up just to have Amber swoop in and take it as content? I'd be so livid. I'd be like, dude, you're doing nothing. And like now you're going to like use all of these images and post like, Dips, I'd be so salsa. annoyed. I did a beautiful you know she didn't do any and of this. cheese and salami thing. I did that myself. I'm very proud. That's Trail what mix, she did. Green olives, veggies, fruits, pinwheels, shrimp. These oh, are like the pesto shrimp. 
mozzarella things. Dana's going to be making yeah, a dip. Yeah, because you didn't make them. Becky's sister is bringing these, like, Oh, Misty, things. is she going to bring the GoFundMe money and that um, she took from all those strangers? Eric and Ricky are making pigs in a blanket. Yum. Okay, you guys. I think it's time for a costume reveal. Oh, God. So Look at hint. all the fucking pizza boxes right there. Do you see all of those pizza boxes? And look at the, like, dude, that's crazy. And you know Eric and Ricky are not the ones eating all this fucking pizza. Because they've been very good about watching their food, what do they eat and everything. It's a red cat, okay. Okay. <laughs> His name is Crooks Shanks. Okay. Oh, she's Hermione. Ready? Oh my god. Dun, ta -da! Hello, my name is Hermione. And I'm no. going to cast a spell on you. Okay, that's kind of hocus pocus. You could have at least crimped yeah, your hair. I'm Hermione. God, her hair looks disgusting, Hello. actually. Nice to meet you. Part of Gryffindor. And Becky's on. The sad thing is, like, that costume is probably the best fitting thing she probably bought from Torrid. On the floor, doing something with spoons. Ooh, look at the arm, though. I'm gonna do a spell on you. It, Becky gives you no fucks. I love Kate Winslet more than you do now. Oh, wait, that's not possible. Check it out. Look at me. So Becky dressed as herself for Halloween? I'm confused. <laughs> I'm trying to go for, you know, someone who was back in the 90s. and. That's what you wear every day. I'm so... I can't, dude. This is... I would literally be like, so Becky, you didn't, you didn't dress up for Halloween? Like... You know, I'm trying. <laughs> you look so cute. You're look, trying. Your That's the try. She wears That's that hat all 90s. the time. The shirt, the sunglasses. You have her little. She wears snap all of this bracelet. all the time. The pants she actually got from Amazon just recently. So if She's you guys want to wear look those like a 90s every day kid. now. Look at those sunglasses. She wearing Woo! multiple sunglasses. I can barely see. These are not to wear in the car or to drive with. Yeah. You're used to your regular glasses, aren't you? That's why you said you can't see. I'm starting to, yeah. Isn't it nice, though, to be able to just plop on some plastic and bam? Yeah. Well, I wouldn't say those are plastic. I don't know. No, the, are they, the, or the they frame glass? or glass, uh, uh, the frames are plastic, and the, of course, the <laughs> glasses are glass. Listening to Becky and Amber <laughs> try to figure out what glasses are made of is, like, what the content I want for 2019, obviously. <laughs> That's a cute couple's costume. See, at least they tried with a couple's costume and everything. I can't with it. And you I think I think that R Eric should have been Luigi because he's a little bitch. And Ricky should have been Mario for sure. I can only imagine what Ricky is. Five guesses. Five guesses. I can't. Ricky They're has no time. Like... Dana and I actually won. Who who is the one who decided this? Becky's I bet like, I bet Beck, I bet Amber dead. was the one who decided. People keep asking winning. about the mattress and the thing. It's because Eric and Ricky. Like, <laughs> 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 no, it's because sometimes my legs hurt. So, but yeah, looking good, folks. Sometimes your legs hurt, so you're they put a full ass mattress in the living room for you to lay on because you can't sit on the couch anymore. If that's not concerning, then I don't know what is, dog. Like. You got lymphedema on your abdomen. You're not really mobile anymore. And now they got to put fucking mattresses in rooms for you. So that way you have somewhere to like sit comfortably. Bro, let's get it together. Folks. Right. Oh, there's <laughs> Twinkie Star and all that weight gain. <laughs> I should have been Bowser. No, I would have been Daisy, you know damn well. No, I would have been Peach. Actually, I don't know. Well, I mean, yeah, you could have been Daisy. She's annoying. <laughs> Oh, what a read. Oh, we're reading now, apparently. The library is open. Okay. <laughs> that was oh, a read. <laughs> Becky, Amber <laughs> won with that costume? <laughs> really? We're well, trying to get a group picture right I now. I hate it when she people, like, 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 just, girl, like, like buy, like, like co costumes and they're like, oh my god, we did so much. It's like, no, nah, dude, let's she's be a little bit more clever picture. about it, at least. Yeah. Okay, let's try again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Yay! Becky is just herself. Hey, okay, Dana, what are you? I'm one of the Disco Girls. Dust, the drummer from Scooby Doo. You look so cute. I'm like dying. I kind of like her. She looks I'm cute. Squid from uh, Rocket Power. <laughs> oh or my Sam, God. whatever you want to call him. You guys did good. I'm just so glad it's not a couple's costume. Why? <laughs> That is so rude. I can't, dude. I love their couple's costume. I think it's adorable. It shows that they, like, love each other, and they have the decency to, like, think about one another. I think Amber was glad Destiny and Dana didn't do a couple's costume because she would have been offended because she wants to be in a couple's costume with Destiny. And she would have been like, you never did it with hey guys, me. So, so we don't get to see the party. Day. Um, you can't see cool. my joker because hashtag... We're Why are you even wearing right now, it, then? Off some money. I prefer... Just to have you know a little bit of money, I prefer cool. using money. I'm happy Anyways. for you. So I prefer using money too. I try not to steal things when I go out. That's <laughs> besides the point. But yeah, um, why are we talking about, to go about grab this? A bite to eat. A bite. Dana and Destiny. A buffet to eat. Me. There's no money. The Is money didn't come out. <laughs> what? What do you do when that happens? Lol. Ooh, that's not a good angle. Let me try 200. These daily transaction limits are fucking hilarious to me. I, I, for someone who makes so much money to be not, first of all, what is going on with the skin around her mouth right here? Do you see this? It's like cakey and like, is that her foundation? I don't, it doesn't look like she's wearing makeup. Her skin looks we like haven't transacted anything though. Have it transacted? I swear our bank is on drugs. But yeah, we're gonna no, go grab a bite to eat. You're just an idiot afterwards. and Becky can't figure it out. Her mom's. That's why there's a pillow back there. So I'm just gonna go in Dana Destiny's car. I'm not really sure where we're gonna get into, but I just want to say hello. <gasps> okay, I didn't even see that. So we're in TJ Maxx. That right was now. a fucking. Looking oh, at God. the Michael Kors because you guys know I love Michael Kors. Just what you need, more shit. She's getting another mini backpack that's not gonna fit. So far I got some makeup, brushes. Or is that her this. mini backpack? I'm not sure yet. TJ Maxx does not mess around with candles. It's like a wholesale store almost. Pumpkin it's like Ross. And else. TJ Maxx is just Ross, but cleaner. <laughs> I dare you to go into a Ross and so not find clothes on the we're ground. We're now at Walmart. Oh, in the scooter. We were in TJ Maxx for ten minutes. Over an hour. Yeah, right. And I did really good in there. Um, they don't have scooters, obviously. I'm in one now because I am exhausted. I didn't How sad. walk the whole time in TJ Maxx, but of I walked not. a lot and I sat down a lot because there was like a seat. I mean, this is where we're at, right? Like you. You could have prevented all of this. And people have been yelling at you at the top of their lungs. Figure it the fuck out. And now you can't even do the thing you love the most, which is going and increasing your hoard at stores. Like, you, if there's no cart there, you probably don't go anymore. Like, have we seen her? We haven't really seen her go out like it's, like she used to. When she would go in shopping, she'd go and touch everything. I mean, I admit, I know we talk shit about the whole touching things or whatever, Christmas but honestly, arrived. I'm at a point now where I would welcome I'm it back. I'm so excited and so pumped. Like, they have the cutest things at Walmart, the cutest little ornaments. Like, look at that. Ornaments? And it's all color-coded. What's an coded. ornament? I'm sure every single store has it color-coded, but I just think it's so awesome. But I'm about to go look at the makeup because I'm... Makeup More obsessed. makeup. So I really want to start painting my nails, and I really like this color. But she knows that makeup goes bad, right? Like she's aware that like makeup has a shelf life. So what's gonna like like with all those fucking perfumes you had? Is this the new thing that she's gonna be hoarding? Is expensive palettes? Like I swear to God, dude, if she starts like getting like Norvina palettes and shit like that, like I'm gonna lose my mind because she's never gonna use any of that shit. She's not even talented enough with makeup really to be doing shit like that. Like you need to just go and get you a Walmart thing and like just practice and practice with that until that goes away and then go and start ex getting the expensive makeup because like you don't even know what you're doing. You're just wasting money. Essie. It's so Bear wasteful. And then she gets the, Ep the, Ipsy, the two Ipsy things a month or whatever. Kid, Thank God yeah, you she don't. Halloween. Jesus, my you God. Guys know Hermione. Look how cute. We don't need a little obese That's baby adorable. running around. 
Look, another one. So that's Slytherin. Yeah. So this is for like that's someone cute. who's like 11. 11? It's for a slot 14, 16. Yeah, I was like, that's a that's big so ass 11 year old. Maybe an Amberlyn so Reed 11 year old. So these like costumes are left over? I think it's just like outfits. Oh. You guys ready to go? You know, it's interesting to me how like with Destiny and Dana, I think it's her way of trying to prove that she can still go out and do things and be appealing to Destiny, but like she didn't do this shit with Becky. She never goes out with Becky. It feels like. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, am I showing you? I can't see it. Get rid of you. My little scooter. I love that Dana got the new iPhone, but she needs money and shit. She needs someone to buy her toiletries. <laughs> I mean, I dude, so I, do I got love home it. a little bit ago, and I'm about to show you guys something. Don't judge me. Please. Is it the lymphedema I on your have stomach? been experimenting, experimenting. Experiencing. I have been experimenting more with makeup, and I feel like it's finally time. And I'm so sure if what? you guys have been watching my channel. Look at that beautiful girl back there. Is she gonna I'm show sure us her makeup haul? For years, you guys know that I've slowly graduated introducing new makeup into my life. I wouldn't say slowly, bitch. You've been buying shit like practically every other day it feels like i went on a makeup spree today, oh god at walmart a lot of people are gonna say that's a bit excessive it is but you guys should look at see this is why she needed to pull money out of the fucking eight this is why you have a, a limit on your atm because they know you amberlyn your bank no they watch your videos the, the the manager of the bank watches your videos and sees how irresponsible you are with your money so they're trying to help you by like putting a limit on your shit the people on youtube they have so much makeup that i can't even like think straight so i'm just those people get it for free <laughs> a lot of those people you watch online that have all that makeup get it for free and then do giveaways giving it away so let's not pretend that they're all out here buying each and every palette a lot of it's pr trying to add to my collection and I'm gonna show you're you such a I youtuber thought, you like, should know that go through every single thing because there's just there's a lot so i got some eyeshadows so hard candy i mean at Milani, least it's walmart makeup so it's probably not super expensive this is revlon tons know what to fucking do of with lipsticks that. you guys from all kinds of brands anastasia Why? we have some nyx l'oreal covergirl milani um two and she doesn't even like, like show it really like and that's the like thing I that said, gets me no polish and she doesn't even like we got Tons of eyeshadow over here. She's not gonna swatch it. She's not gonna like even like show us what it looks like. It's super super dry after I do my makeup, and you guys know that. Jeffree you Star on, swears probably. by this. It's the Poreless Putty Primer, so I'm gonna try using that. This is a dewy mist that'll also help with the dryness of my face. I got the hydrating face primer. Oh god. So she's gonna break out like crazy. I can already I'm tell. To try. So yeah, it's just like a bunch of I honestly think that Amberlynn's saving grace for why she doesn't break out so much is because she isn't putting so much makeup on her face every day. And so I feel like we're about to get like pizza face real quick. Makeup and I'm really excited to try this stuff. Like makeup has become an art and I just love experimenting now. I also got oh this God. really cute makeup bag. This is actually going to be for my You look. literally have like five makeup bags from Ipsy. Why do you need to buy more? I can't, dude. It's so crazy. Six. Just constant shit. I love shit. this. I thought it was super cute. The brand is Taylor Brooke. I am trying a new way of keeping my makeup. And I'll definitely show you guys in a future video. Because so far it's been working for me like really good. So I also ended up getting these beautiful makeup brushes. I think Don't mind really the trash. <laughs> I'm throwing all my um, trash over there. You guys can see it in the corner. All my makeup trash because I just um, took all my makeup and put it away. But she doesn't even guys, get it out of the packages look how beautiful and like these show are. anyone really anything. Makeup brushes. Like and then I got this deep conditioner because I don't use conditioner. I'm going <laughs> to be honest. I really don't. So I'm going to start I, using conditioner tell. and I need to do this about once a week because I need to go back to using it. I needed some hair clips. We got some coconut oil, just some hydrating oil mist for my hair. So this is the new shampoo and conditioner I want to try oh, using. Oh, God. I use tea tree shampoo Advanced, now. Fuck. I got to throw it away. Tea tree and God lemon damn it. Sage. 
It's supposed uh, to be really good for your hair, so I got shampoo and conditioner I use the it. Paul Mitchell Tree so Tea Oil Shampoo. The Gucci perfume. It's in bamboo, and this is what it's it looks like. It's not in bamboo. It's that called upside bamboo. upside down. <laughs> Comes with this big perfume lotion. The lotion doesn't have that much scent to it. Right, because it's a lotion. And a little travel size perfume. Smells really freaking good. And the price was knocked down pretty well. Yeah, it's at TJ Maxx. It was Max. only seventy dollars compared to That's still to like very expensive. Well over a hundred. So I was like, you know what? You could have. You didn't even need the lotion or the and travel really thing. Good. You could have literally just Love gotten the, box. the Gucci like, bamboo Like so cute. Thing. So Becky wasn't with me for half the day because she got busy. She had to go help her mom with something. So I'm gonna so surprise Becky her wears with an these extra, pants. Extra large in them. She loves SpongeBob. She loves that's pajama a read. pants. Because that's what she likes to lounge in. Right, because she's a 90s person. She's really like, nice. I can't, that's why oh the God. costume made I feel no like she's sense. She's gonna like these, so I'm excited to surprise her with them. Okay, you guys. Oh, we're gonna so get comment I of the forget, day still? We Here we go. YouTube ram random comment. I'm people. nervous. So I'm going with the last vlog I uploaded. I know the last video I uploaded was a torrid haul, but I want to. Yeah, do she these doesn't want to hear what people vlogs, have to say about her body. This is a vlog. So last one was Becky's huge hair transformation, and I got a little over 3,200 comments. Randomly pick winner. Honest with herself, L M L M A O. Yeah, that will never happen, which is why she will always be a toxic <laughs> lump of. You don't know me in person. Why did she bleep out lard? <laughs> why did she bleep out lump of lard? That is so weird. She, the way she, she, like, we can read it. We saw, we see what the person calls you. So, like, for you to, like, edit you out saying it, like, does that mean, is it, like, your way of, like, not having to hear it? Or I'm confused. You read it. Like. So, when people say, like, things like this, I'm over here, like, mm, you don't know me in person. <laughs> We kind of do know you. This idea that we don't know you in any capacity is getting really fucking old at this point. You've been on this platform for like six hours, six hours, six years. You post tons of videos. I think she has oval, over, oval, over, see, I'm like l forgetting how to speak because I've been watching this ridiculousness for almost 20 minutes at this point. Um, we, we know who you are. You have almost like 700 videos or something at this point. Like there's... A well documented proof of the person you are. So when people make these, these people aren't making assumptions about you. They're like literally making objective opinions about you. So you need to get over the idea that like we don't see who you really are. We see who you are, dog. We have enough information out there now. If I was these things, I wouldn't have people in my life. People you barely have people in your life, and the people that are in your life are on the payroll. So I don't know if I would use that argument. And, I mean, is it rude to call you a lump of lard? Yeah, but is it factually inaccurate? Not really. I mean, you mostly are fat at this point. You're like 99% fat. <laughs> That's just the way I see it. Her hair looks oily. No way she's watched it in a few days. She has to stink. I'm assuming <laughs> you're talking about me. Because... Yeah, who else are we talking about? Because, yes, my hair does get oily. No, yeah, because do you don't stink. You have to take care of your body. That's very important. Yeah, you have to take care of your body. That's why I have these giant masses growing on my abdomen. And my legs have blown up the way they are because I refuse to do anything about it. Like, don't sit here and try to pretend like you take care of your body, girl. It's very obvious that you don't shower regularly. And during that torrid haul, it was also very obvious that you probably have trouble reaching certain areas. So, stop. Just stop. But, um, yeah, I don't wash my hair that often. And <laughs> like, we I've can talked tell. about that before, um, which I'm going to start doing. I know I need to wash my hair more. I've only been washing it, like, once a week. And so, you literally just, like, agreed with this person. She said your hair looks oily. No way she's washed it in a few days, so she has to stink. She's talking about your hair stinking. And you were just like, nope, you have to take care of your body, blah, 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 blah. And then you're like, I don't wash my hair for days at a time. And it does get oily. Like, so you probably, do, your hair probably does stink because you're a human fucking being. A human being that weighs almost 600 pounds. So, like, if you're not washing your hair regularly, it probably does smell. You just and probably aren't aware of it because you smell it all the and time. And hair's really damaged from it. I'm going to be honest. I used to be a firm believer to only wash your hair once a week. I highly disagree with that now. I need to start taking care of it way more. That was the happiest she looked in days, and it's kind of sad. She's talking I don't about know Becky. Who you're referring to? Because it's not about, about me, you. <laughs> I'm actually, I've actually been in great moods lately. 
it's um, always about Amber. I just it's feel always like I about have Amber. Like my medicine just is talking about really Becky, well. y'all. I'm gonna admit that. So don't be scared to talk to people. If something is wrong, see a psychiatrist. I know medicine is not a fit. You don't. You literally just advocated in. Dude, am I like stroking out or something? A couple months ago, she was telling you about how therapy doesn't work for people. And now she's talking about going and talking. You see your psychiatrist once a month. I will put money down right now. Strike me down, God, if I'm wrong. She probably sees her psychiatrist max once a month. Because that's just what psychiatrists do. They prescribe medicine and they check in with you occasionally to make sure that the medicine is working. They're not there to counsel you. They don't help. Like I mean, some will, but most of them don't. I've said this so many fucking times in this video. If you watch any of my videos, you know exactly what I'm talking about. Fix all. It might take a while to find the right one, but it's working for me. Or if you're talking about Becky. She's um, talking she about Becky. She's going through this something right now, and we don't want to share that. Right, because you guys try to scam people out of money for it. She's always looking sad. Um, it is heartbreaking, but we're trying to yeah, just... Yeah, you can't go online and, like, scam people and make people feel bad for you all the time and then, like, and then in the future want to, like, divulge information and not get attacked for it. That's just, you can't do that. Once you lose that will, goodwill with your audience, it's done. Like, it's never coming back, probably. Let's move forward. And um, I have spent a lot of nights crying, but I am trying my hardest to be. But she's been in great moods. The opposite of that, because I don't want Becky to see me breaking down, because then it'll just make Girl. her break down even more. So I'm trying to be like the strong. <laughs> one in the situation because oh my god to be more hurt than she Self is martyr lynn selfless lynn so. at it again i'm surprised you've never heard that word possibly it's an american thing god this is why you should just do I the top comments this was about i'm sorry <laughs> um that's a reply towards someone bra she's a human being yes we all are and we all deserve to be treated with respect Y-E-S. Yes. You can read. <laughs> um, that's a reply to someone, so I'm going to do one more. Acting stupid is <laughs> yes. not quirky or cute. Amber, you are almost 30. I agree I 100%. <laughs> In Please. two months, I'm going to be 29. I am forever grateful that I wake up breathing every single day, and I try to that was dark. be as positive as I can every single day. And I think it's funny that like people think I'm trying to be stupid. You the do. The sad part is. You do. I love I the am. fucking use the I'm not trying to be YouTube, cute. I'm not uh, trying to be quirky. User's name, cry me a quirky, river. Quirky, whatever the word is. I'm not trying to be anything. I'm just trying to be myself. I'm just being myself, living my life. <laughs> no, you try to like imitate what you see on YouTube from other popular YouTubers. You do it all the time. And you do, per you've said you purposefully say things incorrectly because you think it's cute you've said that this is the thing like i why do you uh she contradicts herself all the time all the time and if you think i'm acting stupid that's your opinion you so are stupid i'm going to go i don't now. think you're I'm acting stupid i think you are edited. stupid i will see you guys in my next one bye Whew, girl. we had another good old tour or not a tour hall walmart makeup hall thing the halloween party was a bust i don't know why you wouldn't even film a little bit of it Maybe it was low attendance and she was embarrassed by it or she felt really out of place there. I have a feeling that like those six people that we saw in that vlog were these total of six people that were in that, at that party. That's just my opinion on it. Um, I, yeah, I'm just kind of shocked or whatever that like, it's just, it's so boring over there. There's just nothing happening. She's getting worse. She looks like she's bigger than she has been um it's not going well over there for her and i don't see it changing at all she doesn't seem like she she just doesn't get it and i don't think she ever will get it and she's now she's gonna be all focusing on like trying to become the next big makeup guru and get on the the shane dawson uh jeffree star pr list and shit like that and it's never gonna happen dog your brand is toxic so i don't know that's just me um thanks so much for watching um i have some videos some different content coming out here and um the next week i just have to like finish editing it with the special guest is my first ever like collab in person i guess so that'll be really fun um remember to like comment and subscribe follow me on instagram and twitter at michael b petty and until next time toodles